With a merry men of Sherwood Forest, we're as happy as can be. We have lots of fun till day is done as we sing so merrily, as we sing so merrily. Many years ago, in the days of King Richard the Lionhearted, there lived in Nottingham, England, a man named Robin Hood and his band of merry outlaws. They lived in the forest and ate of the king's venison and drank October ale. If ever a stranger should pass through the forest, he would hear the merry men and Robin Hood singing off in the distance this jolly ditty. We're the merry men of Sherwood Forest, we're as happy as can be. We have lots of fun till day is done as we sing so merrily, as we sing so merrily. But don't think that everything was always happy for Robin Hood. The mean and wicked sheriff of Nottingham was always plotting a way to capture Robin Hood and his band of merry men. One day he hit upon a plan. I'll have an archery contest, said the sheriff. Robin Hood will not be able to resist the chance of proving to everyone that he is the greatest of them all. When word of the contest reached Robin Hood, he enrolled immediately. But wait, cried one of his merry men. If you go to Nottingham, the sheriff is sure to capture you. Ah, my good man, said Robin Hood. I will go in the disguise of a poor beggar, and I will win the contest and bring back the prize. On the day of the contest, the sheriff of Nottingham was singing with glee. Robin Hood will soon be in the jailhouse. I will capture him and you will see. Robin Hood has tried for the last time to make a fool, to make a fool, to make a fool of me. The sheriff said, Aha, now we will know who is the greatest archer of them all. There are but two men left to compete, Ellsworth and that ragged beggar. Shoot, Ellsworth. Ellsworth shot his arrow right into the middle of the bullseye. There, you beggar, see if you can beat that, shouted the sheriff. Robin Hood stepped up to the mark and confidently sent his arrow speeding to the target. <laughs> splitting the arrow of Ellsworth in two. The crowds went wild. The sheriff knew that there was only one man in the whole land who could have accomplished such a great feat. Excitedly, he shouted to his men to seize that beggar. Robin Hood was prepared for this and had his men waiting to aid him. The sheriff and his men chased Robin Hood deeper and deeper into the forest. But by Robin Hood's shrewdness, he was able to capture the wicked sheriff. When news reached the king about what the wicked sheriff of Nottingham had done to Robin Hood and his merry men, he ordered that Robin Hood and his men were to be let alone and allowed to do as they pleased because of what they had done to help all the poor unfortunate people of the land. We're the merry men of Sherwood Forest, we're as happy as can be. We have lots of fun till day is done as we sing so merrily, as we sing so merrily.